Hi everyone, Pam here from Creative Homescaping. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, I post several videos a week on how to creatively manage and decorate your home. In today's video, I am going to be putting together a floral arrangement using items I purchased from the Dollar Tree and some items I had on hand already. So if you'd like to see how the arrangement turns out, stay tuned. I'm beginning this DIY by painting some white chalk paint, actually off-white chalk paint, over this container that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. I'm actually doing two of these containers. And I ended up putting two coats of the paint onto the containers in order to get them a little bit more covered and not have so much of the uh, metal show through. Then I'm taking the antique brown wax and I'm putting it on with a piece of white cotton t-shirt material. I am making the edges darker and I'm also dry brushing over the letters so that they stand out a little bit more from the rest of the container. Once the paint on the container was dry, I took a large block of floral foam that I got from Michaels and I shoved it into the container. It fit in there perfectly and it held itself in place so I didn't need to put anything around the side. I'm just showing you I have two of the same container. Now the first thing I'm doing is taking this large green hydrangea that I got from Walmart and I'm putting that into the center facing a little bit forward. I like to put my large floral pieces in first. And now I'm taking these cream colored dahlias that came from the Dollar Tree in the fall and putting them in in various places around the arrangement. Now initially I started out putting them more towards the end of the containers but you'll see a little while later that the arrangement wasn't quite as full and I decided I needed to move those ones on the end closer towards the middle and fill in with some other pieces of floral arrangement. And here I am just replicating what I did on the first one and the second one. Now I'm taking some pieces of the gold taupe colored Queen Anne's lace that was from the Dollar Tree around Christmas time and I am putting that into the arrangement and filling in. And here's where I'm moving things around a bit. Once I finished putting the Queen Anne's lace in place, I decided I needed a couple more flowers. So I am going to show you in a second. I put some white roses in some of the other uh, open gaps in the arrangement and just put them around in various spots. I put some closer to the end and then I put some more towards the back of the arrangement. Obviously the green focal point flower is going to be at the front. And now I'm taking some of the Dollar Tree fall leaves that I had painted back in the fall and sticking those around at various points in the arrangement. So what do you think of my arrangement? I am pretty happy with it and everything came from Dollar Tree except for these green hydrangeas which I believe I picked up at Walmart last year and the floral foam it's a bigger piece than you can get at the Dollar Tree I think I got that at Michaels um, but everything else came from the Dollar Tree either in the fall the dahlias or at Christmas time the Queen's Queen Anne's lace or the roses which I just picked up some more of those recently and the planter and I really like how the planner turned out. Let me know in the comments down below if you like it as well, and if you think you'll try something like this. So I'd like to thank all of you for tuning in today. I really appreciate your watching. And again, if you're new to my channel, I post several videos a week on how to creatively manage and decorate your home. So I hope you'll consider subscribing by clicking on the subscribe button in the description box down below or the icon in the corner down there. I hope to see all of you next time, and in the meantime, happy decorating everyone. Bye-bye.